Hey guys, it's Heather. Um, let's go run some errands. I figure let's hang out. These videos are so fun to do. I, I like. I feel like sometimes we're just like hanging out, and then I can like get some chit chat off my chest without those other people saying, "You talk too much." Well, you just mind your business. If you think I talk too much, you're in the wrong. You're in the you're in the wrong room. And I'm gonna do it because it's who I am. And I'm gonna keep saying the word like, 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 and cute. Yeah. Okay, another episode. I think we need to call it that. Another episode of Hanging with Heather. So all we're doing today, very, very little. I wasn't even planning on, I wasn't gonna film because my hair is so dirty. Like the dry shampoo, <laughs> but no, seriously, she dirty. Like we're five days dirty. We and I'm an oily. I got I got oily hair. <laughs> so the bun is bunning. I gotta run out and mail these um, my Amazon gift card um, for the Amazon twenty five dollar gift card giveaway because I just launched my Amazon storefront. You guys check it all the time. Like I just added a couple new um, like categories in there. I'm always adding new links in there. I don't want to show you guys these people's addresses. That's that's private information. You guys can't see that. Okay. Don't be trying to look. We're we're doing that. I want to run to um, Dollar Tree. I want to go to Dollar General. We just thought I'd pop in and see what those guys are up to. Um, stop at the post office. Check my PO box to see if anyone loves me. So what I thought I would do, some people have sent me things in the past, but I never know what to do. Like, do I announce that? Do I show it on my channel? I don't want to make someone feel awkward. You guys don't have to do that. I don't want to make it feel like you have to send me something. That just got awkward. I don't want you guys to feel like you have to send me something. Did that just get weird? That's not my intention. That's, that's not my intention. So anyway, we're also going to, um, I'm going to go to a couple of Dollar Trees. There's a lot of, you know, Dollar Tree is changing. I know everyone got their undies in a bunch when it went from a dollar to a dollar twenty-five. But they're able to bring in like more, better products and different things are able to offer to us. So I've been watching Dollar Tree Instagram videos on what to look for, what's new. Um, cause I don't go there that often to know, um, what's new. Um, has that always been there? Is that something I should grab? Is that going to be gone quick? Is that something people are searching for? Um, all I know is that Touchland dupe, um, although I did hear they're doing a second round of like releasing the, the spray. Um, I, I quit looking for it. I'm, it's a lost cause and I, I kind of feel like maybe Dollar Tree doesn't send enough to stores to create that demand that I need it where is it I can't find it and now everyone's running to their Dollar Trees and oh it's not there but as long as I'm here I might as well pick up a few things oh but I do want oh my gosh that Wiley Wallaby licorice I'm not even sure I'm saying that right that really good licorice. Um, I recently picked up a lemon one at a Dollar Tree. Picked up watermelon and lemon. The lemon one, you guys. I feel like I'm eating like a lemon meringue pie. Like that's that's the lemon flavor that I get from it. I feel like it's it's that. Oh, I'm already starting to salivate. Oh my! I've never seen lemon before. Like I'm salivating because it's so. I'm like. I need some. Oh, I need gas too. My daughter takes my car. She has her car. Um, but if she's running an errand for me, then she go ahead and take my car. Um, I got a small little car. I used to drive a really big um, uh, Ford Expedition. Um, my daughter totaled that. My old, my oldest. She got someone T-boned her, and it got totaled. Um, and if she hadn't have been in such a big car. That would have been a very bad accident, and I'm not sure if. Anyway, we're not. I'm not going to go there. But it was bad. You can see 
where she got hit, like her tire marks in the road where the woman hit her and moved my massive SUV, how far my SUV got slid sideways and where it ended up, where they had said if she hadn't have been in a big vehicle, it, this the whole thing would have turned out so much differently. Um, but she was able to walk away from it. She had a sore neck and a few bruises. Um, but yeah, the lady didn't even stop. She didn't pause, nothing. She just blew right through that, that stop sign. They hit my kid. She, she called us. I beat the paramedics there. I, like my husband drove. I, I didn't even wait for him to stop the car. I jumped out of his truck so friggin' fast and ran up. I think I was barefoot, ran over like broken glass, everything. Like it was like like movie quality kind of stuff, right? And I we I beat the paramedics there. And we lived in like a town at that time, um, where it was you know, it was just down the road. So I felt um I felt like that was a good parenting moment. I, sh I feel like I should win some parenting points. Yep, I'll, I heard, I get a call from her. She's sobbing, crying, can't understand her. She said she got, someone hit her. I'm like, mama coming. Mama coming. But anyway, I just took a left turn there. My, uh, my expedition got totaled and um, I've just, I've never, repurchased a very big car. I've kind of been downsizing. Like, kids are getting older. You don't need such a big car. And let's get this, get this tiny little car. It gets really good gas mileage. And But anyway, I'm just coming up to Dollar General. Going. Dollar, the, the General. We're going to the General. Right? All right, I'll be right back. I'm just going to run in and get something really quick and then I'll be right back. <laughs> Keep it. Any more of these until Piper's potty trained. post office. I'm going to announce who the winners are. Oh my goodness. What the heck? I got to show you guys this. Can you guys see that? All right. So we're in the post office. Let me check my mail. See if anyone loves me. See if anyone loves me. Open it. 
Janine. Janine! Thanks, hon. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> Isn't that just so silly? Oh my gosh, thank you. This is like a little card saying hi. Thank you, Janine. Oh, that means a lot. It's like you guys don't have to do that. Thank you. But then I got um, a package. Oh, so You guys don't have to do that. What is this? What is that? Oh, wait, there's a little note in here. It says a gift for you. Enjoy your gift. I know it's not the snow leopard. Oh, but it was all I could order from Northern Ireland from Michelle. You guys! Oh my gosh. Why is. What are you doing? You guys don't. Seriously, you guys don't have to do that. Oh my gosh. Shut your face. Isn't it the cutest? I'm going to go home and wash this and use it. I'm using this instantly. Thanks, Michelle. Northern Ireland. Thank you, 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 thank you. Oh my gosh. You guys, but seriously, like you guys don't have to do I love this. Like that is so sweet. But I don't want you guys to feel obligated to do that. Okay. So the other two winners, I wanted to run in there really quick. I had to stop because um, th there's a deadline for the mail to go out today. And I asked them if there's, a, can I pay extra to get it to make sure that you guys get these gift cards um, quicker. And I was like, how quickly can I get it there? Like, what what is it? I'm thinking like maybe an extra $5 per envelope. And she's like, well, for an extra 30 some like $30, you can get it. And I'm like, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. $30 total? She goes, no, per envelope. No. <laughs> uh, no. I'm like, you know what? Just put a first class stamp on it. We're just going to cross our fingers and hope they get it in time for Amazon Prime Days. So anyway, the third winner is Ivana Pro. Ivana Pro. I'm going to put it right here. Um, fourth winner is... Um, the YouTube username is Denise G one one two. Um, so you're getting a twenty five dollar Amazon gift card. Well, I mean, I just mailed it, so hopefully you'll get it. Um, let's head to Dollar Tree. Okay, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna go because I'm gonna have a little snack. I packed a little snack in my little snackle box. I had my protein this morning with my little sausage and my eggs this morning with my little glass of milk. I've added a glass of milk now to my breakfast. Um, so now it's like 2.30 and um, I haven't eaten anything since like 9 o'clock this morning. So I'm going to have a little snack from my snackle box. And um, I'll see you guys when we get to Dollar Tree. Okay, bye. All right, we're just getting into the town where... Um, Dollar Tree number one is. Oh my god, my hair is so grubby. You shower all the time, but I don't always wash my hair. I have like set. I have. I think I have like four different phases of showers. There's the everything shower, where you're it's the double wash, deep condition, shave, exfoliate. You know, that's the everything shower. And then there's the. Um, just hit the hot spots. You know what I'm talking about. But whatever. There's several different. Like what kind of shower are we doing today? Like and they all have different time 
what do I have time for today? All right, I'm gonna try and be quick in there because I need to, I don't wanna be gone all day. I'm just gonna do a quick run through. I probably won't even take you guys with me. Um, who am I kidding? I'm gonna take you guys with me. All right, let's come in, okay. They had clear ones. <clears throat> that looks fun. Be good for your purse. No, I feel like this would just get tangled in my hair. You can always take it off too if you don't like it. Oh, this store is always so neat. Like so neat and organized. Oh shoot, I, they had like berry ones. We don't have them here. Forty or fifty. I like the packaging on this though. I like how it just fits in like your purse. I mean, it's nice you get Timmer wipes, but I like I like them packaged like this. So I'm gonna get those. I'm actually, gonna get two of them. I'm gonna get the lemon from my kitchen. I'll get two of them. Oh, the dollhouse. Oh, these are nice, like natural ones. And then there must be medium. Must be doll clear band. Be more natural looking. Oh, and then you can get them like this. I like that. I'm gonna grab these. I'm gonna try it. Alright, let's go check the candy and we're gonna go. Okay, so back in the car. I didn't want to record when I went down the candy aisle because like they had four employees in the candy aisle. They were like restocking it like everything and rearranging stuff so wow that was a loud car anyway so they did have my lemon i'm so excited yeah i grabbed six bags and then two watermelon if you're a lemon kind of person um go get these they're so delicious especially if you like lemon meringue pie you know that that it just reminds me of that kind of lemon that that rich lemon you know, not the fresh lemon or a super sweet lemon. You know, it has 
has that little bit of a tang. Rich tangy lemon. Right. So anyway, we're gonna go to the next Dollar Tree. Quick run through. Go to Aldi because I want to get some more berries. And then um, I think I'll end the vlog there because um, once I get into Walmart, I just want to go quick. Um, just because I want to get home. It takes so long just because we live so far away from everything. And I don't want like, to get into like super late. And it's, you know, I like to go home and have dinner with my husband, you know, with husband. I might have to use their restroom because I have a bladder like a two year old. I think I might have to park way over there. Oh, that person's taking up two spots. Well, that's not good. Let's not be that guy, okay? You know, the guy that takes up two spots. I'm gonna use the, the, the uh, restroom. What do you guys call it in other countries? The restroom, the bathroom, the water closet? I've heard that before. Um, the loo. What do you call it? I wanna know. All right, I'll see you in there. Thank you, bye. Have you guys haven't tried this? So good. <sighs> Pink and strawberry kiwi. Rich and creamy ultra hiding co-wash. I don't know about this. So I think I'm not gonna get that. It's the last one. See right there. Well, oh, here's some more of those um Okay, so the other one had these two, but it didn't have this one. Fig and black tea. I don't even know what that would smell like. Let's try it. Oh, Salon Selectives. Oh my gosh, you guys. I used to use that um, when I was in high school or middle school. I used Salon Selectives. Oh, these wipes are all gone. Well, they got a different scent. What's this one? I'd love to get Piper a ball, but um, since Maggie's so big, I worry about balls getting stuck in her throat. So, I get her little harness. It might be too big for her. Let's see. I didn't have much there. They usually, I usually don't have good luck here. Oh. Boy, people just back out of parking spots and they don't even look. What you doing? I gotta get home to the pipinator. All right, I'm gonna run in and get berries. Okay, you guys wanna come with? <laughs> you push the cart. I'm just gonna grab stuff and throw it in. Okay, bye. Anyway, I got my quarter. Let's go to Aldi. done. I ended up grabbing a watermelon on my way out. It's so tricky to get a sweet watermelon. But I've been uh, researching how to find a good sweet watermelon. And the last watermelon I got, it doesn't get any better than that one. It was so perfect. Well, I suppose there's always room for improvement. If it ends up 
feeling heavier than it looks, um, that's a good sign. I'll insert a picture of what uh, watermelon webbing looks like. Um, and then like little tiny pinholes. That means um, like bees were pollinating. They're, the bees were doing what they're supposed to do. They're, they be pollinating. Um, what else is another one? Oh, the yellow, the flat, creamy yellow spot where it was laying in the in the dirt. Um, you want that to be like a creamy yellow. So if, when you follow those steps, those simple little, usually you can get a really good watermelon. All right, I gotta go. I'm gonna try and get all this stuff out of the sun. Put it down here so it's not baking in the sun. Bring my water in because I get thirsty. Okay, I get, I get, I get, uh, I get thirsty. All right. Oh, I wonder if she's no. She. Would, I wonder if she's here. If you know, you know. And if you don't know, you're gonna have to go back and watch. Not my last hanging with Heather. It's the one before that, where I tell you the story about what happened. Right. So if those that know, you know. And uh, I'll have to turn my camera back on. So maybe just hang on a second. Maybe the video's not quite over. We'll see. But if it is over, I'll see you on my next one. <laughs> Bye.